Hello, everyone. Thank you for tuning in. A little Madden NFL 15 action on the Xbox One tonight. Make sure to visit us at VGRevolution.com. So right now I am playing Connected uh, Franchise um, in week two of the 2014 season, playing as the Giants in owner mode. So as you can see, not much has changed right here from the basic stuff as far as you got all the information you had last year. Uh, you know, you can see your team is tracking in various uh, financial stats and you know stadium stats and stuff like that. So got all that stuff there. You can still juggle all the you know financial parts, ticket prices, concession prices, um, you know. Again, not much of that has uh, has changed. The one thing in the connected career that has changed that I absolutely love is the game prep. Um, obviously, you can delegate it if you want. Um, I've actually been enjoying going into it. But as you can see, it's not just the normal grind and grind and grind and grind um, of really long practice sessions uh, you have a couple different options here so depending on what you do will uh, you know alter how your team progresses um, so you can you know you can just go in here and earn XP you know good for long-term growth you know if you got a young team that might be a good way to go uh, you got improved confidence which is gonna help uh, how your team plays um, uh, some drills now some of these that I'm gonna go into uh, I'm gonna do a little QB stuff here um, some of these actually require you to be on the field and play uh, some of them are just automatic uh, but what happens is every week you have 35 hours of time and as you can see these that I'm flipping through right now cost 18 hours so it's up to you to pick what you want to do you'll see where the focus is QB group I think I saw running back or defensive back linebackers um, so you know it's up to you uh, I actually did that last week so uh, let's do a whole team uh, practice here and accept and this is gonna be one of the automatic ones um, you could select certain players that it's going to focus on um, it automatically, you know, kind of picks the best. Uh, kind of like these choices, actually. So start the activity, and there you go. Let's see that it increased these three guys' confidence. Um, here's the experience that they ended up getting as well. Um, and there you go. Uh, obviously, as you go, it will give you uh, more history data as well so we did that so I just killed out 10 hours uh, no it didn't wow why did that kill out 30 hours oh because there's three of them so it's uh, 10 hours per, per per player so I got five hours remaining let's go over here there's a couple one hour ones and there are some short ones it's a matter of finding them Out where they were, I think down here. Let's see, there we go. Full team hour. Let's see if I can find anything else. So I'll just do this a bunch. Oh, nope, can't do that. Uh, oh. Yeah, so not enough time. Where is this one hour? So full team scrimmage. Automatically picked five guys. Let's. Uh, you know what? My linebackers were a little rough. The Saints. So let's. Uh, let's take that off. Let's find. Uh, let's do. Just used up all that time. Uh, 
Now, the one thing that's weird is it's still saying this, so I don't know why exactly. Maybe we can use the left stick. And then it just tells me what these guys are doing. Temporarily raises and real lowers ratings. Drill, drills. Overview. Okay. So, that doesn't help. Don't know why it doesn't check off, but I just delegated and it finishes it off. Whatever else it's supposed to do. All right, let's uh, let's jump into a game here. I'm gonna shut up for a little bit, and uh, yeah, let's see the amazingness that is uh, Madden NFL 15. I gotta say, I am stunned by the uh, graphics, uh, especially the broadcast presentation that they've created this season. It's pretty amazing, actually. So, but I'm gonna shut up for a little bit and. Uh, I'm Larry Ridley, and this is the NFL on EA Sports. Two teams will need their quarterbacks to step up and leave their offenses on the gridiron today. It's Lux Colts going up against Manning's Giants. Now we'll go down to Lucas Oil Stadium for this matchup. It's the NFL on EA Sports, the preseason in full swing now, as we join you from Lucas Oil Stadium. Hello, friends. Jim Vance along with Bill Sims. Just prior to kickoff for this primetime extravaganza, and this adds another whole layer of excitement when you have this game under the light. I think you said it right. Center stage, players love it. Anytime you turn on the lights, they know it's special, and it brings out the emotion out of these players. And also, though, let's don't forget, the fans, they've been here all afternoon getting ready, so we're going to have a loud crowd also. The Giants are ready to run back this kick. And Pat McAfee has this one teed up as they gear up for kickoff. One weird thing I found is uh, for some reason there's no coin toss. Don't know why. But, yeah. Breaks the tackle. And he's tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22 yard line. Manning's the man in charge of the offense here today as he continues to be the starting quarterback now in his 11th season. First down, offense readying for the snap. The Colts go with the dime formation here on defense. Looking across the middle, brought down at the 32. A lot of times you look at the drag route and you think that's the safety valve. You know what? It is. The quarterback has always thought to look down the field. If there's nobody open, throw it to the drag route coming across the field. That time they did it, it's just short of getting the first down. Loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime. The Colts defense now loading up, expecting pass with a dime defense. Nice tackle. Nice job that time by the defensive end. He's not fooled by the run play. He holds his position and makes the tackle. First down here after the run. The Colts will come out in the dime. They go screen with Jennings. And he is brought down at the 39. 
That's a nice route on the outside. Nice throw by the quarterback. Puts him in good position to keep moving and get a first down. Here we have second down. They come out in the dime package. Step it out of the gun. And he hauls it in. And he's tackled, but not until he picked up the first down. The catch is made for a first down. Well, that was a nice job by the offense. It just puts them in a better position. Nice little throw and catch. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. The Giants all bunched up here as they get set at the line. Toss play to Jennings. He's going to be swallowed up behind the line. As we talk about the offense, Ruben Randall has gotten better every year in the league since coming out of LSU in 2012 as a second-round pick. This is going to be a breakout year for Ruben Randall. He's big, fast, and strong, as we talk about all the time. Those are great qualities, and he got better last year. Look out. Coming up, second down. The play clock's running down. The Colts set at the line. Dime package. Away from the ball, there's a flag down on the field. Second down here. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. Eli Manning takes it from the gun. Looking to the right side and throwing. Davis tackled down after a gain of five. Number 10. The leader of this defense is linebacker Dequell Jackson. Every defense needs a guy who just knows how to get the ball carriers to the ground, and that explains Dequell Jackson. Now looking at third down. The defense comes out in the dime. Trying to beat the play clock. Manning standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. The hit knocks the ball out incomplete. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. They're in punting formation. is the franchise. The franchise quarterback, Andrew Luck, who has had two remarkable seasons in the NFL. Andrew Luck shows everybody he can throw the football down the field about as far as any quarterback in the National Football League. When you look at him, he's big and strong, and the arm matches it. No margin for error here with the offense. Offense lines up here. Tight ends in motion here. First and ten. Luck still has it. Fleener's got the catch and the first. On his way. 
the 20, the 10. Nobody was going to catch him there. Touchdown. Good job that time by the offense, scoring that touchdown and putting him ahead. And when you get ahead in a football game, the National Football League, it makes you relax and you play better. The Colts now will tack on the extra point. It's good. The Giants prepared to return the kickball. Beckham is going to test the coverage here. And he's taken down right at about the 29, not quite to the 30. Number 13 on the return. First down here. And Manningham's lined up in the slot. Set up screen. And gains maybe four. Well, when you keep chipping away with these short throws, sooner or later, that defense is going to come up. And when they come up, that's when you throw it over the top. Second down. Loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime. And Jennings got it on the handle. And Jennings is brought down. Third down following the run. Receivers are bunched up. Play clock's running down. And Manningham's got it. First down. That's a really good throw and catch, and they get the first down. Jim, that's what you want to do. Pick up that first down. Now you give your offense three more opportunities. First down here after the completion. The Colts come out in a dying package. They're going to run it on the toss. Breaks away. He's tackled right at the 48. That'll be second and four after the running play. The Giants are at the line of scrimmage with a spread formation. Manning's back in shotgun formation. Got the completion. Games 16. Good job by the receiver that time. Getting that extra couple yards gets a first down. They are marching. Let's see how the defense reacts. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. The Colts with two extra defensive backs in the dime. We'll switch sides and take a quick break as the first quarter comes to a close here in Indianapolis. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. The NFL on EA Sports is brought to you by Snickers. You're not you when you're hungry. We're back here in this low-scoring affair. It's first down as they head to the line. And Jennings lined up now as the running back behind the quarterback. 
And the second quarter is underway with this snap. Ends up picking up three yards. Second down coming up. They've come out in the dime package. Get ready. Grab 38. Grab 38. They're setting up screen. That's a nice job by the offense there. Get the first down. Keep those chains moving. Give yourself three more opportunities. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. First down following the long play. From the gun, out to the left. Giants, touchdown! Touchdown New York. Well, the offensive line did it all on this drive, didn't they? Here it is on first and goal. Nice job of pass blocking, and the quarterback finds the open receiver for the touchdown. The Giants can tie it up with the point after. Makes the PAT. Got a tie game here now, and what's been a good one so far. The score's seven to seven. Josh Brown about to boot it down the field. of scrimmage first down and Richardson's lined up as the single back gets the handle here they knock him down and he's still two yards short of the first good job that time by the offense power run gets him a few yards that leads us to second down will take it right from the center. Ballard's going to receive the toss. Taken down a yard short of the first. You gotta give a lot of credit to the defense. They were all over the run that time and they only give up a short game. Now third and short following the run. Feeds him again. Good for only a yard. A running back must always know the situation. It's third and short. Don't be looking to break it outside and go for the big run. Get the first down so the offense can stay on the field. Nice job. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Hasselback's got two tight ends on the field for this snap. Now makes the move to the right. Good job of the defensive line standing in there and fighting, and they hold the running back to a short game. This will be second down. Hasselbeck's got it in the gun. He brings it in. The old expression, just move the chains. That's what they did with that throw and catch that time, Tim. It also gives them a chance for three more downs. And the defense will use one of its timeouts right here. That play is going to be challenged. Challenge flag is out. There's no question he caught the ball, but there is a question whether or not he got both feet in bounds. Well, first off, you want to make sure it's a clean catch on the sidelines. Does he have possession of the football? And then once you declare he has possession of the football, let's look down at both feet, see if they're in bounds, and don't forget, 
you must must maintain possession of the football as you go to the ground. The coach's challenge is not answered. The play on the field will stand. Yeah, that's a tough. You know, I think it was up to me in this situation in the game. I would not have challenged knowing those timeouts, how important they are. We'll see if that lost timeout comes back and hurts it. Halfway through the second quarter. The defense gets a sack. Hasselbacks, the injured player, and we'll take a break. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. We're back after the injury timeout, and Danielle Bellini will have the update on the injury in just a moment. And now they'll try over again on second down. Offense lines up here. Ballard's going to take the handoff now. They'll mark him at the 28. The Colts offensive line is just whooping some tail today, aren't they? What a job up front. That helps the running back get in space, get down there, and pick up a big game. Quarters formation here for the defense. The Colts take it from the 28. And he's taken down. Well, the defense has got to be excited. Anytime on third down they make the play, uh, they get pretty fired up. But when you sack a quarterback on third down, that is one happy and emotional defense right now. The kick is good. The kick is good from downtown. You always want to be rewarded for a nice drive in a football game, even when it's a field goal, because you've made a lot of good plays, you've executed them, you got yourself in position to get some points, and that field goal just reinforces everything. Colts are ready to kick it away. Cruz is running this one out. And he's out across the 20 and tackled at the 21. First down on the way. Last play before the two-minute warning. Out of the gun. Makes the reception. Gains 17. Halftime is coming up, but first we reach the two-minute warning. Coming up at halftime, please stay tuned for the Verizon Halftime Report, presented by EA Sports. All right, following the two-minute warning, we've got a defense trying to maintain the lead as we head towards halftime. Ryan Nasib backing off the line, shotgun formation. Let's go, hey. First down at the 38. He's wide open for the grab. Tackles made. Well, I think we've heard this expression about 7,000 times. It's a passing league, so we all know that. So you got to be able to throw the football and pick up some first downs. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. From the gun. Parker's got it. And a first. Well, you get a couple first downs. It just gives you such great confidence. It makes everybody relax. And I always say this. When you're a relaxed athlete, that's when you play your best. That was a big gainer. Now it's time to back it up. Dropping back now into the shotgun. Looking out wide. Wilson's brought down after picking up six on this play. Second down coming up. They're going to the hurry up. Back to the line. The give. Searching for space to the right. Wilson's brought down, but not until he gives his team a new set of downs. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. The defense comes out in the dime. 
First and goal from the four. Screen. He makes the catch. Swallowed up behind the line of scrimmage. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. Wasting little time. The Colts go with the dime formation here on defense. Second and goal from the six. That ball has been picked off. And no return this time as he takes a knee. Freeman's probably going to go to the sideline telling, hey, I got such a good pair of hands at that interception that I should play some tight end. I don't know about that, but I'll tell you this. He is one good linebacker. Allen's usually a tight end, but he's in the backfield this time. Ballard's hand at the football, and that gains a few. Well, a short gain on the run that time by the offense. When you're running football team, listen, there's going to be a lot of ugly plays that don't work. You just got to keep running it. Second down and seven. Harris is taking the handoff. He's brought down at the 25-yard line. We'll switch sides and take a break for halftime as the second quarter has come to a close here in Circle City. Back to Indianapolis after a short break. All right, welcome to the Verizon Halftime Report. Let's take a look back at the first half. Both teams have arguably played well enough to be leading at this point, but you see the score and realize this one may very well come down to the wire. So let's take a look at some of the highlights from the first half. Now midway through the first, Fleener's got the catch here on the quick pass, and this play goes for a score. Colts strike first in this one. Now early in the second quarter, Asset's on target here, and he'll end up picking up 23 yards on the play. Later on the drive, the quick pass, it's complete, and this will go all the way for a touchdown. We're tied back up at seven. Colts have it midway through the second. Rogers the target here, and he won't be brought down until he makes it to the 33-yard line. So that'll do it for us. We'll send you back down to the field where Jim Nance and Phil Sims are on the call. Giants ready to kick it away. He'll take it from the one. Just across the 20 and tackled at the 21. The Colts bring their offense back onto the field for their next drive. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. The third quarter begins with this play. Taken down at the 27th. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. Vic Ballard is in the backfield. The Colts from the 27. Ballard's going to secure the handoff. Rocked for a loss on that tackle. Well, that time the offensive line just got overpowered. They allowed penetration. When you do that, nowhere for the running back to go. What a good job by the defensive line. The Colts will take the snap from the 25. He's got the catch. Shakes off the tackle. for a quarterback, I'll tell you that. I loved it. Throw a little short pass and just root your guy on and watch him break the tackles and score a touchdown. Pretty exciting stuff. The Colts with the PAT to come. The point after is good. Hasselback's going to watch his defense come out here in a moment. He was good for over 70 passing yards on that last touchdown drive. And they crash into him, ending the return at the 20-yard line. <laughs> they 
They face first down. Play action fake. Looking to throw. What a hit, and the ball falls incomplete. There's been no shortage of big plays today with this quarterback at the helm, Phil. Oh, my gosh. What an arm this quarterback has. How about these throws down the field? Not only are they far down the field and beautiful, they're right on target. And the good thing is he has receivers who can take advantage of his arm. Wilson's in the backfield. Single back set. Tackles made, and the first down is picked up. When you pick up first downs against the defense, they will get tired. That time, nice job by the offense getting the first down, even though they're losing here in the game. First down and 10. Throws to the right. Robinson's got the catch and the first. You know, when you throw the football like that down the field, you pick up a first down, now you can do anything you want on the offensive side, and you got that defense guessing. First down here after the completion. Let's see how they back up the big play here. Keeps it here. Pulls it in. And he's tackled at the 32-yard line. Good job getting the first down by the offense. And look at the defensive players on the sideline cheering their teammates on. Keep us on the sideline a little longer. That's what they're hoping for. Wilson's lined up in a single back formation. Freeman, that time on the tackle. Wilson's trying to be patient, but there is nowhere to run that time, and he only gets a short game. That's second down coming up. Ryan Nassif will take it right from the center. Wilson's got it on the toss. And that's a big-time tackle that keeps them three yards short of the first down marker. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run. Third down now. And Jennings on the right side, split out wide. Out of the shotgun formation. He'll throw it over the middle. Catch made. Jernigan's tackled down after a gain of 15. Well, even though they're down more than seven here, the offense down the red zone, it'll be good for them for the rest of this game. Their confidence uh, for the offensive coach that they can punch this in for the touchdown. Nickel formation for the defense here. First and goal from the 10. Setting up screen. Makes the catch. And that's good for only a yard or two. When you get down in the red zone, the offensive coordinator's got to call a play that deceives the defense. Let's see if he can do it. His team is down. He needs a big play here. Second down now. Loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime. They'll hike it to him out of the shotgun. Underneath and incomplete that time. When you get third goal, a lot of times it just comes down to who's willing to fight the hardest. We'll find out here in a second. Only eight yards to go. They've come out in the dime package. Third and goal from the eight. Cuts down and drawing close. Touchdown, Giants. Terrible job that time by the defense. Third and goal. They're expecting pass, and they still can't stop it. This defense is just not fast enough to stop those touchdown passes. The Giants with an extra point try on the way. Add the extra point. The kick is good. The Giants will take their spot on the bench after contributing to the cause, especially via the passing game. Over 60 yards by the air. 
Richardson's going to test the coverage this time. And they stop him from running it out to the 20. Mark him down at the 19. First down coming up. The Giants defense now loading up, expecting pass with a dime defense. Ballard's got it on the handoff. And at the 25, he'll be brought down. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt when you fake it and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. Ballard's lined up behind his quarterback as the single back. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Good job by the offense picking up a first down there. They've been terrific all day long. They're winning the football game, and they are tiring this defense out. Allen's in the slot here for this play. The Colts take it from the 33. Had it, but dropped it. Rodgers is going to go back to the huddle and look at all his teammates and go, my bad. Well, they know that you were bad. Everybody, even the offensive linemen, they saw you were open and you dropped the pass that was right to you. But, hey, that's the way it goes. You know, you got to keep the confidence up. I think he will. And I'm sure the football will find its way towards him again soon. Rodgers, a receiver in the slot his mark and that's a gain of nine well the drag route that time picked up solid yards these receivers sometimes they get a little nervous running these drag routes or these short crossers because they are afraid so a defender is going to come out of nowhere and hit them that's the quarterback's job see in front of the receiver lead the guy to the open space that's awesome. Every time you pick up a first down, what does that do? It shortens the game and also keeps your defense on the sideline, and they get the, get rested up and ready for their turn. But you got a lead here. It's a small one in the second half. Keep getting those first downs. Matt Hasselbeck will take it right from the center. The final quarter begins with this snap. Gets about four yards that time. After running it, it's second down. The Giants will come out in the dime. Looks to his left. Has his man. Bowman's there that time for the tackle. There has been good pass protection for the quarterback all day long. He has not been sacked much, and he throws it there and gets another completion. First and ten. Ballard's going to take the handoff now. Able to take the football out to the 28-yard line. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this over a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. Allen's a tight end, but lined up in the backfield for this play. And he gains maybe three. If you want to run the football to success, you're going to have plays like this where they pick up very little yardage. Don't listen to the fans. Keep running it, and it'll work. The Colts will take the snap from the 25. He'll fire it out to the left. That's been the story of this game. Another third down conversion to move the chains. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they can come up with a play that fools the defense. Hey, hey, 380. 380. Now first and ten. And he's thrown to the ground. Well, that time the quarterback didn't hold the football. The left side of the line just... They just collapse. He doesn't even feel it or see it, and he goes down for the sack. Marching down the field and taking their time. Blue tip. Blue tip. Hey, hey. Ballard's hand at the football. Game's five. The defense got to be a little aggressive here. Your Number team is down. You've got to attack this offense. You don't want them to get in there and get another score. Third down on the way. This has been a long drive so far. Right back to him. 
this time they fail to pick up the first on third down a rare occurrence here today defensive coordinators love this situation don't they third and long they can do just about anything and it's going to work and they stop the offense that time and he converts here on the field goal drive that was a nice long drive by the offense that time and it stalls out but good job by the kicker coming in and putting three points on the board are ready to kick it away. And it's the same as a touchback as he's tackled right at the 20. They come to the line and it's first down. Hyam is running out. The defense knows it's playing with the lead but doing whatever it can to just try to run out the clock. These guys need to make something happen on offense with time beginning to run out. The Giants take it from the 23. Looking to the right side and throwing. Robinson's taken down at the 40. And now we reach the two-minute warning. Here we are. The offense has two minutes to try and erase the deficit. First down. Pressure on every snap now. Wilson on the screen. Ducks out of bounds. I think the best thing to say about that play, it's just a, it gained a few yards, so that's what you do. All plays don't score. Sometimes you just want to pick up a couple yards. will take it right from the center. We'll go ground. They've got him behind the line of scrimmage. Trailing every third down so big at this point. Third and seven. He'll keep it on the play fake. Has his man. Well, I think we all know the situation here. It's a close game in the second half, and you're losing, but you pick up a first down. Oh, my gosh. That opens up many more possibilities what you can do on the offensive side. Good job by the offense. It's Wilson in the backfield. Get ready. Press the yard. Press the yard. First down at the 47. Brings it in. And the tackle is made right around the 39-yard line. Second down coming up. Time, obviously, a factor the rest of the way. Let's go. The Giants have it at the 39. Airing it out. Incomplete. Almost going in the other direction. Phil, it's third down. They are in four-down territory, and the defense knows that. Yeah, and it, you get a situation like this, Jim, on the defensive side, you need one of your pass rushers to come through and get on that quarterback. Third down and one. With two hands, he has it. Freeman's there to take him down. This will be the eighth play of this drive. And Jennings, a running back normally, but this time lined up as a receiver in the slot. From the shotgun, still got it after the play action. The Giants look pretty confident out there on the field, don't they? And they're, they're very calm, and they should be. That first down, they're right in this game. Down a couple points here in the second half. Don't look down the field for that big play. Just keep marching. Throws the pass. Very nearly intercepted. Well, Jim, I threw a lot of passes like that in my career where it should have been intercepted and the guy dropped it. You just go, yes, I got a break. Now can you capitalize on the break? The long drive continues. Play action. Secures. It's a touchdown. Touchdown to New York. 
Man, the defense has to be down at something like this. They allow the offense to score that touchdown in the red zone. My gosh, you only have such a small part of the field to defend, and they just didn't get the job done that time. The Giants now just an extra point away from taking the lead late in this one. Extra point was good. So we've got a late lead change and a receiving team that will try to find a way to bounce back. Richardson's going to run this one out. And he's met head on right there at the 20. First down. Let's see what they come up with here. Vic Ballard is in the backfield. First and 10. Dwayne Allen makes the grab. The Colts will need to get to about the 35 on this drive in order to kick a field goal. Every play is huge now. Second down on the way. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. Second down and six. The defense gets the sack. The Colts call the timeout. Their first on third and long. They'll be in four down territory here. Allen's moved away from the tight end position to now a receiver in the slot. Third down and 13. And the quarterback is taken down. And they're going to call a timeout here to stop the clock. Crucial play here. Fourth down on the way. The defense comes out of the dime. Hasselbeck's going to take the snap from the shotgun. Complete to Allen. Ooh, they failed to pick up the first, and the ball will go back to the other side. The Colts were a desperate team, and they had to go for it, and they had to pick up the first down in that situation. Yeah, in your situations like this, it's desperate times. You go for it on fourth down. That's tough. The play call, the offense, nothing they can do. Couldn't pick up the first down. It's now second down. Loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime. Let's go. Takes the knee. You've often talked about prime time and how the players of today have this it's all about me kind of a mentality and for you at the booth you had to enjoy it being all about you having a chance to call this one today in prime time that's right it's all about me and it would have been if i could have just got you to be quiet for a few minutes but it's awesome to win in a game that's featured in everybody in the country all your peers they watch you it just doesn't get better what a memorable game this truly was. For Phil Sims, Danielle Bellini, and Larry Ridley, Jim Nance saying so long for now, and we leave you with the GMC Never Say Never moment of the game.